times Make sure you like, share, and subscribe You guys, I know I have to put a little bit much in it But guess what, y'all? Today we are going to be making some Mexican tacos No, Mexican pizzas <laughs> Mexican pizza, y'all And I got this idea from watching Claudia uh, Regalado so go check her out, y'all. She has the original video that I watched. Now, I'm not, I'm not sure if she's the first one that did it, but she has the video that I watched. Of course, it's easier, easy to make, but when I saw hers, I was like, oh, that looks so good. I should maybe make that. So I'm making it um, the way, well, not exactly the way that she did it, but somewhat. So we're going to get started, y'all. Um, I'm going to use a half a stick of butter, unsalted, to start my meat process. I already washed my hands. Y'all just gonna have to trust that, okay? This is a spatula. So y'all, I'm gonna try to make this quick. Oh, I'm gonna have to turn that down. I got it on medium. Hey, Louise. Anyways, y'all, so with uh on Claudia raw uh on Claudia's video, she sauteed onions and um she sauteed some some uh Dang, is this too hot? I think this is too hot, y'all. I tried to calm it down. Let me calm it down for me. Anyway, she sauteed onions and tomatoes. So that's what I'm going to do. Saute all of that together. It can calm down now. So she didn't do uh, bell peppers. So I add the bell peppers. Y'all know I'm extra. So I had to add the colorful bell peppers. I love bell peppers. And then she has sauteed some onions. So that's what we gonna do. And then we gonna, and it calm down a lot. Then I'm going to add the hamburger meat. Now, usually a person will use, this is one pound of hamburger meat. That's all you need. If you're gonna do a smaller family, one pound is good. But I'm gonna do two pounds because I have all my family here. And I'm sure they're gonna be looking at my face wanting a Mexican pizza. Okay, okay. So that's what I'm gonna give them. That Mexican pizza. Okay, so I'm gonna add one pack. And what I got, the kind of meat I got, I got the uh, the 93% lean, 7% fat. So if you guys want to know what type of meat, that's the type of meat I'm using. And this is, of course, ground beef. Ground beef. I don't know if you want to do, is that the same thing? Ground chuck? Chuck, chuck, ground beef, ground chuck. Okay, we're going to do that. So we're going to saute this, y'all. And y'all, I'm just used to using a spatula. How many out there use a spatula to cut their meat, chop their meat up? Now, I got me a meat, a, a ground beef chopper. It's, uh, I think it's made with four square, but I don't, I don't like it. It's all right. I just like to use things that I use, you know what I'm saying? And this works for me. I know a lot of people that y'all cooks don't agree to cook like this, but y'all... This is how I do it. I hope y'all y'all can got a C in my pot. But just know, we got some ground beef. We got some onions, some tomatoes, and we got some variety of bell peppers. Now, this is going to be our meat, y'all. And then, we're going to season our meat now. Now, on Claudia's video, if y'all, if anything that y'all about, it, I'm like, I'm getting tongue-tied. If you guys are watching, you know I said I, I got this uh, recipe from what? Her name is Claudia um, Regalado. It's either Regalado or Regalado. Lotto. Anyways, uh, with her, she made her uh, taco meat, her taco seasoning with seasoning. You know what I'm saying? She made it by scratch. Which I could do that because I had all the ingredients, but I didn't just didn't feel like doing it. So I said, okay. Let me just get my taco pack because I got a lot of these taco seasoning packs anyway. So I said it's already made, so I might as well use it. Do what you gotta do. Woo woo. Woo woo woo. Woo 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 woo. Okay. And you know taco meat don't take long to um, um, cook at all, y'all. But while that's going, I'm gonna put this in there and I'm gonna start putting the seasoning in there, and then I'm gonna start um, shredding my. Uh, I don't want to make this video long at all, y'all. I even pre-chop my veggies. So y'all know I'm getting better, y'all. I'm getting better, better, better at this. Because you know I usually keep y'all. I'll be like, man, y'all finna stay with me while I chop this. Y'all finna be with me when I do this. I know you be like, dang, girl, nobody want to be with you. Why don't you pre-chop that stuff? But anyways, I'm going to chop that up. So I'm going to add some seasoning to this because this is not the only thing I got to make. 
So we're gonna do the whole thing, y'all. Y'all gonna go through the whole process with me of doing this thing. Cause we're gonna make it good. We're gonna we gonna make Taco Bell know it today. We're gonna make Taco Bell know it, okay? They got rid of the Mexican taco pieces, the Mexican pieces. And I was like, I was bummed about that. And everybody, did y'all see that petition they did on it? They did a petition about it. Uh, uh, about them getting rid of it. And I think they had over, it was hundreds of thousands of signature, y'all. Signatures of people that wanted that taco back. Not taco, but Mexican piece of that. Now, if y'all wanna know what I'm using, I'm sorry. See how I am? Y'all better to watch Claudia because she is professional, okay? But this is total seasoning I'm using. I just used some lemon pepper, garlic powder, cayenne pepper accent. I have the uh, tahini pepper, Creole seasoning, and onion powder. That's what I just used, y'all. Y'all know I like my food very well seasoned. This may be enough too much seasoning for some of y'all. Y'all ain't gotta use all what I use. Y'all don't have to use the bell peppers either. You ain't gotta be extra like me, but you know I like that extra flavor and extra pop to everything that I do. It's just the way that I eat. You know, everybody ain't gonna wanna eat what I eat, but it is what it is, y'all. It is what it is. So, while that's doing that, we got that together. Got my little garbage right here. I should take the garbage out because that is probably not gonna look too good. So, garbage over here. Y'all, chop that up a little bit more. So then, I'm gonna start shredding my cheese too. So this is mild cheddar. I'm not gonna use all this, I don't even know, but I'm gonna put them in um, baggies when I'm done. And this is pepper jack. Now you, and then I'm gonna use some shredded mozzarella because they were all out at the store of uh, the block ones, block mozzarella cheese because everybody took it for uh, Thanksgiving making a making the uh, macaroni and cheese. Y'all know what I mean. So I got the pepper jack on deck. So this is the cheese I'm gonna um, try to, y'all I like this grater, I really do. Because it grates very, very um, good, fine. Um, views on the road she is good too she is amazing with her food now she said she's been cooking since she was four years old I love her my son Darius he loves her too I mean he is crazy about views on the road I love her I love her spirit I love her person I always like her even when she was just doing move on she's amazing and you know what who else is 
be trying to create some the meals that they be having. Um, it's so good. It's so good. Miriam. I love her too. Now you gotta be careful with the cornstarch. You don't wanna add too much. You don't wanna make it too thick. So this is how your Misha look. Y'all see that? Hey, how you doing? We just got back from Walmart. So I'm gonna put this in here. And then we gonna get on the tomato sauce. And all we gonna do with the tomato sauce is we are going to, we're going to season it and put it to the side. And then we're gonna start creating our pieces. I just got some tomato sauce, y'all. Tomato sauce. So this is uh, Contadina's Contadina tomato sauce. And we're gonna put a little bit in there. Well, actually, I'm gonna do all of it because I ain't gonna be able to, I ain't gonna use it. I ain't gonna want to use it. I'm gonna season it all, so I might as well just keep it all in here. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna do a lot of se seasonings again. This on the stove, y'all gonna be. Hmm. This how it goes. So, okay. this is spice, spice day. so we're but what I am gonna do yeah. is we're gonna get these together. So we got a pot right here. We're gonna put this on medium though. And then we have the, 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 the things right here. And I'm gonna use a little oil, y'all. I don't need oil if I want the oil. I think I'm gonna use a little the spray. I was gonna look the oil. Barry, that's how you have a whole conversation in my video. You can, they that cannot hear me. They cannot hear me. Nobody just came up what I say. I'm too tall for this. That's crazy. I've never been tall enough for anything. Mom, that is hot. It's hot? Yes. Oh, should I put it on low? Yes. I did. No, that's on medium and it's hot. We don't want to the barn, shoot. What are you putting in there? Some um, grease. Oh, some shit. Sort of Y'all gonna eat the Mexican pieces or what? I, I think so, or he said beat ups. Oh, how, you could ask him, because I'm not gonna be cooking these things. How are you um doing this? What you mean? I mean, what do you, how you make, what do you, so. Huh, what? I don't know what you're asking, so. I'm asking you what you're doing with the shells. What you mean when I'm doing the shells? Like, how, what do you want, about to make them, you about to fry them and make them hard? I'm gonna make the shells of uh, hard, right? By frying. Yeah. That's what I thought. They probably like, okay, Darius, get out. I yeah, got... because they don't know you don't know what you're doing. What? Well, what? What? Well, mm. well. And so Darius think, think he's Chef Barty. He's gonna be doing a few couple cooking videos here and there. Yes, the girls are set up over there, ready to go. But you're gonna be setting up right here, right? Yes. So y'all, oh, I learned a trick. So you gotta put holes in this, okay? You wanna stick holes right. in it. So that, right, so that way. That so way what? That way, because because when you're making um, the dishes with you know, bready dishes and things like that, there's layers, right? And so what happens those thin layers at the top is they start to bubble up and air fills in them. So what you do is you stab the holes in there so that you don't get those big puffed up, you know, um, kind of bubbles in the, uh, in the tortilla. 
So, what we're gonna continue to do, I'm just kidding, I'm getting out. I know yeah, yeah, you better get out now because you're gonna get roasted. Eat. No, that's the reason why you they do don't it. play no games over you here. You should probably done it to both sides. No, you don't have to do it to both well, sides. Well, I don't know. Because I get the holes all in it. Right, okay, but is it all the way through or? She be putting her head, whole hand and I be like, danger girl, danger. Danger. Okay, well, I what guess I'm just gonna say? eat this then, but. What is, what is this? What What's is, that? What, what is this? What are you trying to do? Well, I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna get some, I was gonna go get food. You ain't eat fit food, you can eat this. I'm gonna make all y'all some. It's funny. So, I'm gonna make a lot of these, y'all. I'm gonna make it, and then we're gonna put it, some cheese on, and we're gonna build it. So, what, let me just show you my spread. So, I know y'all didn't see what I have. What do you say? So, I have, we have right here, we got the onions, we got the, uh, the banana peppers, we got the uh, olives, pico, cucumber, and we have serrano peppers. That's what they call, right? Where? Which ones? The the uh, green ones. I'm just kidding. They were whole peppers. No, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I'm making that up. You making what up? I want you to put them. So this is the pan. We're gonna put everything on, y'all, and we're gonna build it from there. We're gonna put it on here because you want to put it in the oven, and you want to just have that. There, you gonna need an assistant, right, on your video to put everything up, you know? Okay. I'm at to do it. Now these are gonna be little. What I would suggest is y'all get the um the bigger ones that's more rounder. What's the call? No, you maybe not one. I'm gonna have to make everybody two a piece and there'll be a it's be a be a good size. I'm back. So I'm just kidding. Okay. Did you just open a new one? Is it the same one you had? What? Oil? The grease? Yeah. It's the same one I had. I forgot. I'm, I have many, many, many recipes that I have in the chamber. That he for gonna you guys. do. Um, many recipes that I have, and everybody is mad. It's okay. They mad. They mad, Darius. No, you're mad. Oh, I'm mad. Yeah, oh, you are mad. Oh, okay. Anyway, it's you. Um, <laughs> you're the one. You're the one that's mad. I'm the one. Yeah. Um, so. He said, you mad. Not them. You. Um. And I will be making them. Come on now. Mo I've, and everyone's gonna be mad when I when I give you guys a vegetarian meal and it's delicious. I have multiple vegetarian meals, and everyone's gonna be going, "Wow, that's crazy!" Just they're coming, they're coming. They're coming, y'all. That's what he said. So is that just supposed to make them more firm, or did you? Oh, I guess it is. See, I probably, right. Yeah, and then once you get the uh, stuff on, I'm gonna have them all right there. You put the toppings and everything that you need to put on there. It's gonna get hard. Yeah, this is so y'all. This is a time-consuming process. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm probably gonna make these, and then I'm gonna come back and show y'all um, how I'm gonna build it, and then we're gonna put it in the oven. I already got the oven preheated for 350, and we're only gonna put it in for like three minutes, and we're gonna take them out, and they're gonna be done, and we're gonna have us some Mexican pizza. No. <laughs> no. No what? Mm -mm. What? Please don't ever do that again. Why? <laughs> we have that, we're gonna have a, a a class after the the. Uh, no, we're gonna do it. Thing. We're gonna do it. Thomas McGee. <laughs> no, no, no. Anyways, um, fun fact while we're waiting. I know the girls hate me. Anyways, fun fact while we're waiting. And I bet you didn't know this, and neither did Nicole, and I bet you no one in this household knows this. What's that? But, and I found this out watching a cooking video, and I did scream when I found it out. Did you know that the reason why you cry when, did onions? anybody, yeah, you, you know why you cry when you, when you cut onions? No, why? Because, now nah, girl, I heard this from somebody else, so if they wrong, if, it, if, if I'm wrong, blame them. Yeah, you guys. No, we ain't gonna blame them. Yeah, she's blaming them, not me. No, because you repeat it. Now listen, this is what I heard. This word on the street is, that onions have sulfur in them, and when you cut up the onions, it releases the sulfur juices and gas, and it goes into your eye and mixes with the water, creating sulfuric acid. So, really? That's what I heard. Now, I should fact check that right now before anybody says, Girl, you're lying. <laughs> 
<laughs> you better fact check it. Because you know folks be sitting up there and will go but off on you. I did scream when I figured that found that out. But that's what I heard that it just it it creates sulfuric acid in your eyes, mixing with the with the uh Whatever is in your eyes, it makes the sulfur gas mixes with that and it creates whole sulfuric acid and it burns. Mm. And that's why you cry. Mm. And then when I heard that, I said, wow. Did you stab it? No. I said, wow, that's crazy. I'm going to say, why do you cry when you cut onions? Onions produce the chemical irritant known as... Is it sulfur? Girl, it's not, <laughs> so, it's not sulfur. <laughs> it's synropentheol oxide. Oh, oh. Listen, so first and forward up, it would, it's all the same thing. It simulates the eye's lacrimal glands, so they release tears. So everything, I, oh no, wait. The synthase, the synthase enzyme converts to amino acid sul, sulfo, sulfoxides. Sulfoxides. They, sul, they, they, they eat you up. Sulfoxides and onions. Okay, I'm going to say. Into sulfuric, uh, yeah, sulfenic yeah. acid. Sulf, so we got closer and closer. <laughs> we got closer and closer. The last step is sulfenic acid, not sulfur act. So, what did I just say? Girl, I'll tell you the science, it's not, I can't do it. <laughs> sulfuric, I said sulfuric. Sulfenic, um, I have never heard of sulfenic acid in my life. So. I haven't either. Anyways, um, it creates sulfenic acid and it, and it basically releases the glands that make you cry, but it also burns because it's sulfenic. So, and then what I was gonna say, <laughs> was and that's why you cry so so the, i just want people to the, come to the home. channel and know that they're going to learn something there is now my channel Let, let's take this out to i'm going to cut this part out and put it in your channel in your video i just want people to know that they can come to your channel and learn something they can come to the channel and learn because all they're going to do is roast me and tell me what i don't know learn something. you might not be learning the correct thing <laughs> but you're going to learn something you're going to learn you might be learning you what's wrong learn how to not say that in your videos or on in life don't say what we say, okay? And don't do what we do. Because sometimes we crazy. Well, he is crazy. What? Mm, it's mostly right. you. Speak for yourself. Speak for yourself. Did you also know? So this is one of y'all. I'm making these for um, Dalvin and Nicole. I'm just making them two a piece. I've and then they got to let me know what they want. And, um, when Nicole's I'm, down here, I Dalvin. I just want one, I think. You just want one? Yeah. Aw, there's you want one? Actually, um, I can make more, so I can put more on here. What was I, what was I gonna tell you? Actually, so, three well, three no, don't one. get too full because I'm cooking tonight. I know. I'm not gonna get full. I'm just letting you know. So, what I was gonna say was, oh, you um, did you also know that when you're making enchiladas, mm -hmm. you know um, the corn tortillas that are like this size? The corn ones that they, the corn ones you eat all the time. The corn ones. The corn, yeah. These are flour, the corn shell. The corn ones. Yeah. Um, Don't tell me crazy nuts. No, is it nasty? No. Okay. Cause sister girl's gonna be like, no. Which one you just? No, I, I did. I did like this. There's. It better not be nothing. It's that I not nasty. Eat, I got some in there already. It's not. And nasty. I gotta eat them. Now listen. The process of making them, they use goat dung. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just <joking. laughs> Anyways, uh, what I was gonna say was, um, when you're making enchiladas. Sorry, that scared me. When you, I want mine like that actually though. So I don't want mine like that. There is. You're quiet. When you um, when you, sorry, there's just so many beeping things. Is there something in the yeah, microwave? Yeah, take it out, Darius. You get it. I'm gonna let you guys know right now. My mom loves putting stuff in the microwave and then just leaving it in there for ten minutes. So after it's done, and that thing just beeps for ten years. I actually. I, I, That's beans. Take it That's, out. I knew I didn't like it. You want beans on yours? Absolutely not. There's my beans is good. And beans are nasty. Now they, let me share my fried beans. I said take it out. You opened it up. Cause you know I can't touch it, mom. You. <laughs> they hate me. They hate me. They hate me. Yeah, they hate you. They hate oh you. They hate God, you. Not, you don't care about me. Smell like peanut butter. We <laughs> all. It don't smell like no. <laughs> I'm gonna knock you right. It don't smell like no peanut butter. I don't like beans. Whatever, dude. Um. Oh, he gets on my. Anyways. Right. Go ahead, start talking. So when you have the corn ones, and let's say you're making um enchiladas with the corn shells, mm -hmm. what you have to do first, and I didn't know this, is you take some a little bit of vegetable oil and you like put it on. You baste it a little, not baste. Oh, it, you try. You talking about they want to make it like, professionally? 
not professionally, but if you just make it enchiladas, you know how they rip when you eat tacos? Mm -hmm. Like they just tear, they're very, they're very fragile, right? Mm -hmm. So to make them less fragile and more durable, all you do is you put a little bit of um, vegetable oil on each side, make sure it's like cold, a thin layer, just thin, you don't need too much, mm -hmm. cold both sides, and then put it in that pan for like, I don't know, a minute or like not you don't want to cook it at all it should it should be very low on the pan like a very low heat mm -hmm. but what it does is just makes it more durable and i didn't know that and then you can roll them and do whatever you want to do with them with that little thin layer of vegetable oil and it makes it not crack oh. and that's how you make it because you're trying to roll the things in the enchiladas that would normally break with those corn tortillas mm -hmm. yes okay. yes thanks for that Darius. you're welcome guys you are welcome i know you guys want me out of the video and it's fine i'm gonna stay but um you said it is fine. I'm going to stay. I did say that. I did. Um, so, I'm, I'm spreading refried beans on here. This is going to be mine. Oh, no. This is going to be Nicole's. She wanted refried beans, and I'm making her two. Each person gets two of them. So, one of them, you put the refried beans on. You don't have to put a lot, depending on what you like. Some people don't like it. My, my older son don't want one. So, I'm not going to make him one. My younger son... Don't want it either. Do I want one? So one, one, two, one, two. There's only one one, so I'm gonna put one on this one too. Cause I want some refried beans. I wanna see how it tastes. So I'm putting a little bit, little bit, little. Now I brought these refried beans from the store, y'all. And it's very, um, just one can. That's it. It wasn't even that expensive. I think it was 98 cent. If that. Well, one something, y'all. So. Okay. So we should only have three of these good things. So then, this is how we doing that. I'm not. I'm gonna put a lot of meat on mine. I like mine's more meatier. I don't like and dairy's is not a meat eater. So. I now that one never want to do that video, but I'm gonna do that. They have to do that video kind of quickly, cause uh, sister girl hungry. I want me something too. So, you got three tacos like this. So now we are going to put the meat on all the tacos. And they're gonna get crunchy, y'all, as they go into the um I need a plate. Darius, go give me a plate. So what else happening? Next is the meat. So y'all see the hamburger meat? This is the hamburger meat, and y'all spread the hamburger meat. I actually don't want to use a spatula to do the hamburger meat. Thank you, Darius. Can you put those? No, I, I, you didn't wash my hands. Oh, okay. Well, you didn't, so, well. I'm like, okay, and you didn't wash your hands. So. Okay, let me get a spoon. Mom, is everyone here to get this stuff? Just eat the Um, If y'all get the other stuff out the refrigerator on the hallway, I mean hallway. So this is the uh, hamburger meat. They stay out right now. Huh? They they gonna stay out right now. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna be finished in a minute. I thought, how's this? I just gotta find space in there. I don't wanna find the. Uh, you what? I gotta find space in the refrigerator. Uh, Basically, you gotta move out the stuff. Actually, I think it's room in there because I just cleaned that out. I did. I'll throw on top of that. Bring it. Okay, y'all. Now y'all don't have to spread that much meat. This is not that meat too much meat, but this is really nice. I think they're gonna be full. Cause y'all, this is some. Cause you gotta put the other thing on top. Oh man, you gotta be very, very, very tedious. A tedious job, y'all. And I like a lot of cheese. You're about to do that. What? Yeah, I'm sorry to call. What? My Mac. I gotta put it upstairs. Oh, you got your bank delivered? 
Yeah, I was been here for a couple of days. I know you gotta do it. And it was a lot to have to deliver it. Yeah, Dad, I hope you checked in. I should have doubt. Dad, I'm trying to do this video right now. Yeah. Ask me to do it now. Let me do mine now. It's gonna take me 20 minutes. Okay. Well, if he can wait, if he not can't, then let me know. Mom, you got your face on this face ID? Huh? You got your face on this? Face ID? What? My who? Your face ID. Do you use What's that? ID? You don't know what face ID is, Mom? No. My face? Oh, no. I don't use that on that. Why? I don't know. Okay. It's not going to be good with y'all. Y'all got to get that refried beans on there. He's gonna have to take everything a lot of his thing out of here. They can run it back in and out. Okay. Y'all, this is a long process. Shoot. I ain't know it's gonna be this long. I'm gonna place the beans. I'm doing sour cream on mine. Oh. Yeah. Do Dad like sour cream too? He, I don't think he likes it a lot. I don't know if he likes it. He yeah, give me like the sour it. cream. Do you want me to put it on top of that? No, you don't have to make mine. What? Oh, don't make yours. Right no, now? no, 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 not right now. I can't do it. Now. I, didn't. Okay. I mean, I, I am going to eat right now, kind of. But I don't know how to make it. Huh? I don't know. Do you out. want me to make it now? No, 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 no. Don't, no, no, no. Are you doing your, are you eating right now? What did he say? He said you can do it. Okay. I'm going to do my spice, though. But I'm going to remake it. Are those all yours? Or you, what do you, oh, wait. Oh, those are the tops over there. I was like, why'd you put them both on both sides? So don't make yours now? No. You can put you can still put beans on that mix and make that one of the real things. No. Okay. So you don't want yours? Not right now. Okay, so now y'all, this is the uh, process. I don't wanna put theirs in the oven in. I'm gonna put theirs in the oven last right after me. No, oh, is that like some sauce or something that you put mm -hmm. on it? Can you get this? Can you move this? But well, move that pot. Okay, this no, is this. Oh, just the pot. Yeah. Move that. Yeah, thank you. So this is, y'all, the tomato sauce. Y'all know how they had a tomato sauce on top of. So this is what that is. I'm gonna spread that on there. And like I said, y'all can season the way y'all want to. Y'all, I was looking at this stuff, y'all. I, I was watching them make her make these tacos. I was like, oh, I want that so bad. So, so bad. So, I know this will come out good. And then you put it in the oven for three minutes to let the cheese melt and everything. Oh, uh, I was a little confused. Why? Because I was like, why'd you put the sauce side up? And this is, I don't know, this looks like a little weird. This is weird? Well, I forgot what Mexican pizza looks like. I thought he was gonna pick it up like a sandwich. For some like a sandwich? I don't know why I thought that. When I know what Mexican pizza looks like. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So there's a side for a little bit. You're just making yours right now, right? I should just. I'm gonna put mine in the microwave. I mean, yeah, in the oven. And then I'm gonna put this in the oven so that it's gonna be hot. Yeah, after you get done, you yeah. can make that. I can still put the uh, stuff on it. I need a So y'all, I know this is a long process. I'm gonna cut all of this stuff off. it is I'm gonna add all the stuff so y'all gotta tell me what y'all want on y'all um, okay Darius is getting pulled away
course y'all know I want everything. Kablam! So I got uh Ooh, look, look at that one, so, it your <laughs> That's great. Yeah. so I got pepper jack y'all in some mail cheddar on this thing. I like a lot of cheese so I think so, yes why. Never mind. Never mind what? Never mind what? It's the one with no beans. Yeah. So these two are down ones. What I want to sneeze? If you ever think about having a sneeze, you want to sneeze. What about this? Woo! What is it? What is it? What is it, y'all? Ooh, that don't need to fall on nothing like that. That's good. That's good. Is there gonna be enough cheese for me? Yeah. I don't think there is. I don't think there is. It's not then. Oh well. Oh. Oh well. We got plenty of cheese here. This is pepper jack and mild. Did you want pepper jack or mozzarella? Well, it don't matter to you. Oh me? Yeah. The sales must have been so no, good. I was telling you on, on Monday. The Did you tell your daddy that? Tonight. What? Did you tell your daddy that they still been some of the sales? No, I didn't. That's the Nicole was the one who knew that. I didn't know that. I don't know, but I said you should tell your daddy that because he doesn't stand the sale. Well, whatever. Talk about it later. Okay, so now. Now the toppings, y'all. So, get all the cheese on. Now we're gonna do the toppings. Now the toppings I have a different variety of toppings. Now you can put your toppings on later, last, or the front. Should I do it last? I think I want mine last too. I think I want last, y'all. Because I don't want hot toppings. That's just not. Oh, I hope I didn't get that. No, I didn't. Okay, so I'm gonna put theirs. I'm gonna put theirs on the side. Okay, y'all, I'm ready to take them out now. I'm finna take it out. I'm finna build it. Darius, stop talking. I'm talking. Boy, I ain't taking that part out. Huh? I ain't taking that part out. Oh. Hey, y'all. How you doing? So, y'all, that's the cheese looking. It's melted, y'all. Hey, hey, hey! Now I'm gonna add my toppings, y'all. Now I got some pico. I got some green onions here. We call these what? Chives? Is that the correct word for y'all chefs? I want some chives. Sprinkle some chives. You said chives, right chives. Chives. Like chives. Like Why jive turkey. Like that? Jive turkey. Chives. No, no, no. It's just chives. I said chives. Chives. <laughs> you ain't gotta say it like that. It's chives. Ugh. Nicole, that was your fault. Okay, so I'm putting um, chives on there. I'm putting pico on mine. Pico, pico. Um, I did have tomatoes on the side because some of my family does not like onions. And so I try to make sure that I have the other stuff on the side. I got the serrano peppers over here. I'm gonna put that on next. I do got cucumbers. Now that's an added bonus, y'all. Y'all know everybody don't like them cucumbers, but I love cucumbers. It's giving your food a fresh taste. It's so good. You gotta try it. If you guys haven't tried it, just try it. Now this, uh, you can actually make your pizza the way you wanna make it, y'all. You know how it is. You build it the way you want it. So I'm adding the uh, few cucumbers. And I'm going to add banana peppers to mine. The banana pepper, they call them, yeah, they mild banana peppers, y'all. Is it? That's what they call? I don't know what they 
Are they, that's what they said? Okay. Yeah, mild banana peppers. I'm gonna tell y'all what kind I buy. Yeah. These one. These are so good, y'all. Y'all see my banana pepper rings? My mom, I look, I look. So, let's get the serrano peppers on there. A few peppers here. I like a little spice. A little. What happened? You just. Oh. Y'all, this. Darius, don't move. Stay like that. We just playing the mannequin game. Y'all, I'm so sorry. This is a lot of stuff on here, huh? Mm -hmm. I don't care. I like olives. I like olives. Actually, I don't think I've ever really had black olives, but just the This thing gonna be heavy. I mean, you probably gonna eat one of these and you'll be good. For some of y'all, I'll probably eat two. I'm gonna eat two of mine. Y'all know I'm gonna eat two. Tearing it up. I love olives. Black olives, y'all. Thebomb.com. Absolutely not. Now, ew, I just remember my my friend eats pizza with oh, <laughs> one time I used to at his house. And he said, um, I said I'm hungry. And he said, okay. We, got, we just got orders of pizza. And I said, oh, okay. So I went downstairs and looked at the pizza. Girl, it was cheese and olives. I said, I'm good. <laughs> I said, I'm good. I'm good. I'll sleep tonight. <laughs> that is so nasty. He just had cheese and olives on there? Yes. That is literally disgusting. That is disgusting. Cheese and uh, olives. Those of you that eat cheese and olives, it's not disgusting for you, I guess. If you no, want it's it. it's disgusting. Okay. It's just olives. And I said, you know what? Never mind. I'm, I'm full right now. I'm so, I don't. Never mind, never mind. Y'all know this is a lot. But shoot, I like mines with all this stuff on there. You ain't got to put all this stuff on here. Okay, that is the end of these pieces, y'all. So let me get y'all a close up. Oh, shoot, I'm going to put these gloves on. It's still hot? Yeah, it's still hot. I do my stuff hot and right and tight and right. No, I'm just saying. You said so, the wrong side of that glove. Uh -oh. I don't care. Whatever. So y'all, this is the finished product of the pizza tacos. Ooh, Mexican pizza, Mexican pizza. This is gonna be my thumbnail. Okay, y'all. So this is the end of this video. You saw how I made the Mexican tacos, and like I said, I looked at my girl Carolina. That's how Car That's her name, Carolina. What well, I said, Carolina. What's her name? My phone in here. The name that I said in the beginning of this video, that's who you go check out, y'all. That's who I got it from. But anyway, she makes some very, very good recipes. And also, um, y'all know I've been watching View, Views on the Road. My son, I told you my son loved her. So, that's it of this video, Mexican pizzas. And this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to eat this pizza. And I, I'm going to enjoy it because I'm hungry. See y'all later. Peace out. Peace, love, and hair grease. Share and subscribe.